everyone and welcome to another Minecraft video. I've spawned in a village house and you can see that bedrock wall behind me because that Aww. marks the first end of this chunk and so does this wall. This house has actually been cut in half. Uh, can you move out of the way please? Thank you. So, I'm stuck in a big bedrock box with two villagers and these crops, which I can probably take before we go. So, we are playing the Minecraft One Chunk Challenge today, and it's basically in the name. You survive in one chunk for as long as you can. And you have unlimited resources. The only rules are, I can't escape this chunk, basically. So, I honestly, I have no idea how this is going to go. I've done Aww. things like this before, but I can tell you that this is actually 16 blocks wide. So this is at 762, and then it goes to 777. Seven, seven. I miscalculated, didn't Aww. I? No, wait. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay. Yeah, just silly with the coordinates Aww. I am. So, I've spawned with a house. Aww. Two crop spaces and two trees. I deliberately put those trees there because, you know, I thought I'd make the challenge a little bit more easy. Because, you know me, I'm Empty George. I'll, I'll always find a village to put myself in and make the challenge easier for myself. And I'll still end up not doing very well anyway. So, this will be important because this is my only source of wood. Well, this is the only source of renewable wood at the moment. My plan is to dig down and see what I can find. Hopefully a cave that I can explore without it actually being cut off by the bedrock. And the bedrock does go all the way down. It goes absolutely all the way down. So, I have a plan. Also, I can hear an iron golem on the side. Shame I can't get to him. I do have a plan on how I can progress. I'm going to... You know what? I really don't want you harvesting all my crops. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna trap you inside a boat. I hope you don't uh. mind. Uh, you're gonna have to come in the boat as well. Oh, are you kidding me? You can't fit through? Oh, I've got to make some adjustments. Well, first I'm gonna just dig down here. I'll make myself a little staircase, and I'll start getting some stone. And there we go. All of my stone tools have been made, a furnace, and also some bread, because, you know, I don't want to die of starvation. Now, the plan is, first I'm going to trap you guys in a boat so that you guys are not going to cause any harm or interruptions to me whatsoever. Next, I'm going to... Actually, I'm going to leave that tree there. I want to try and get a sapling. I, I think the leaves are not falling because I placed them there. But you know what, I got a sapling straight away, so I'm not complaining. I'll just use my hoe and see what I can get. Okay, that's all the leaves gone. I got three saplings. That's actually really good. And the reason why I placed them down instead of just, you know, growing them, is because, well, I wanted to make sure that there were no big trees. I wanted to play this for real. Okay. <laughs> Now, my next plan, this is going to be a huge plan, I'll need to make this crop bigger. So, that involves me needing to remove this wood and expand the crop area. Okay, and with this dirt that I have in my inventory, I can just use that until that. And we've got another 19 seeds we can use. There we go, because this is basically my only source of food right now. And I'd also like to harvest all of this grass, see how many seeds I can get. I did just bone meal some grass, just to, you know, make it look a bit nicer. I guess my plan did work, but the grass is gone now. No more grass for you. I got six. You know what, that may not seem like a lot, but that's very good for me. I'm happy with that. Now, I need to make a chest and like a base thing Aww. i'll be living inside that half of a house as you could probably tell why wouldn't i live there i'll just place my chests Aww. up there that's actually a pretty nice place to put them i'll put all my useful stuff in there then i've got a crafting table furnace you know all that jazz Aww. 
Now, I would like to go down, dig down here and see what's down in the caves. But I would probably like to use some ladders. Because I think that's going to be a much better way of just getting around. Like, getting around down the caves. Because then I'll have to dig less. And also make this just a lot quicker. And, it, I mean, I guess it does get me less blocks, but I don't really care about that right now. So we'll see if we can get any bonus saplings off of this. Huh. We definitely got at least one. It was two. Nice. Two saplings. Awesome. There we go. Got some saplings planting. It's very nice. All right. I'm gonna... Oh, I'm gonna need the wood I just put down back. It's okay, I don't even mind using up all the wood right now. Because I've got a renewable source. Oh, there's two more saplings in here. Nice. I can plant some more over here then. I'm sure if I just do that, then they'll turn into dirt and I can plant the rest of them there. Yeah, there we go. I can make a stack of sticks. 30 ladders is not going to be enough. 57, 78. That's more like it. That's not even going to get me to Y0. It's going to get me to Y... Um, hold on. 87 minus 78 is 9. It's going to get me to Y9, according to my calculations. So, I think I'll start digging here. And I can place ladders along the way. Okay. I'll see you guys in a bit when I've used up all my ladders. You know, I also just realized one thing. I, I'm not going to be able to see down there. So I kind of used up all my wood already. But you know what? That's okay. Because there's always the side of the villager house. Yes, guys. This is why you... When you do the one trunk challenge, you make it yourself so that you can spawn with whatever you like. I'll have the crafting table just sharp outside, why not? Now I can... Oh wait, I'm actually going to need the logs for charcoal. Wait, can I just use... To... Mm -mm. I'll keep that in the house. Alright, I'm going to actually need these logs to be logs so that I can make charcoal. Also, we're about to experience our first night in a very lonely place. So, I'll go to sleep, and I'll also put some torches around the island. You know, I don't want any mobs spawning. Mobs can stay down there. Thank you very much. Huh? So, yeah. I'll go to sleep, wake up in the morning. Huh. Okay, it's morning. I'm not really going to bother with the rest of those for now. I'm just going to place them around the island, so we'll have one here, one here. You know, it's convenient that I can place them on walls, one here. And one down here as well. Nice. Alright, that should be enough for now. I'm gonna use the rest of this. Um, oh, I don't have any more sticks. Well, guess what? I have another piece of wood. There we go. More sticks. And we don't want any other walls showing. So we'll place that there. Ooh. Everything is going how I wanted it to be for now. And we'll continue digging again. Okay, I found something. It may just look like water, but this is huge. We have a cave system. This is... Oh my goodness, there's a creeper. We found our first mob that's, that's not a villager. All right, I need to place ladders. Ladders. Yes, there we go. Okay, we found life under here. Uh-oh. Okay, it didn't do any damage. Okay, this is really interesting. Yes, we found iron and we also found coal. Okay, I didn't even plan this to be here. Oh, that's promising. It sounds like there's quite a lot of zombies down there, but I'm just afraid that they might be outside of the border. That might be a little bit annoying. Yeah. That might happen to me. I might find something good and then it will be outside of the border. We could check anyway. But I doubt they're going to be inside. Oh, 
hold on a minute. I can see cobblestone. Okay, I didn't plan this. I promise you, I did not plan this. Oh, we've got a dungeon! But the rest of the dungeon is on the other side! How unfortunate is that? Oh, what? Can I at least... I just want to see through. Yep. The dungeon is on the other side. That sucks. You know, it would be really nice if I could go there. Looks like I have to suffer. Wow, I could have had infinite zombies. I'll learn for next time. Um, anyways, there seems to be nothing else interesting inside this really stupid water cave. I've already got water, so why would I do this? You see, I don't, really. I'm just gonna box this up so that I can dig again without getting water everywhere. Okay, this should be good. Nice. I'll continue digging from here. Okay, I just went in my inventory to get the ladders out, but I've just found more iron. It was right on my digging down place as well. <gasps> more water as well! This is so cool. Oh, it's just one block. Oh. Okay, I must have forgot to patch that up. From the stuff. Oh, we got flint as well. Nice. Okay, we're actually... Not doing too bad down here. We've got six iron. That's cool. I don't know what it's going to be used for, though. <gasps> Another cave! Wow! Look at me go! Let's go. How did they go in here? I did not place them in there. I was up right against the wall, placing them against the wall, and then you decided to place yourself there and fall to you, and then you went all the way down before I could reach you. Oh, we're actually out of ladders. Well, I'll need to borrow one of these, then. Oh, I can't get up. Sorry, right, I'll use one of those. There we go. You know what? It's kind of convenient that we found this right at the bottom of our ladder thing. Because then we still got hope when we reach the bottom. And I'm going to get a nice little staircase down. My, my pickaxe broke, and... I don't... Wait, that's planks! That's planks! We've got a mine shaft! Wow! I didn't plan any of this cave stuff. I'm going to be 100% real. I just found the village. I went, yes, that's got a crop and a house. Nice. Wow, that's really cool. So we've got a mine shaft. Hopefully, there's a mine cart with chest. Because that could have some nice resources. Hopefully, there's a spider spawner. Oh, if it had a spider spawner. We have pigs! We have pigs! But I can't breed you because I don't have any of the breeding material. We need carrots, potatoes. You know, I could get carrots and potatoes if I had zombies. A rare drop from zombies. Well, it looks like you guys will be food instead. I need to wait for an animal to spawn that... I can actually breed, like, uh -huh. chickens, or cows, and pigs. Anyways, the rest of my charcoal is ready. Uh -huh. And uh -huh. we've got some more loot for the chest. <clears throat> and you know what? Now that I've seen that, I have to explore the mine shaft. Uh -huh. I just have to. I need to see what's down uh -huh. there. So let's go. Okay, we're back down at the cave bit. Oh, I want you over here. There we go. Now I can successfully get back up and stuff every time. Here we go. This is it. This is life accomplished right here. Found a mine shaft in the one chunk challenge. We have gold as well. <gasps> Cave spider. Wait. Wait, does that mean he got through somehow? Oh, wait, what? Oh, oh lot. that's a lot of iron. Tell you what, that's a lot. Okay, it was five. Another five. Alright, there's cobweb. Oh, they make a new breaking sound. I didn't know that. But you know what? I have to know if there's a cave spawner somewhere around here. Uh, a cave spider spawner. Yeah, that's what I meant. Trust me, guys. 
Okay. Okay. Don't mind me. Okay. So the border is here. And. Okay. I, I don't even know where the border is right now. So it goes from there. Ends somewhere over here. Oh, it ends here. There's another cave over here. Didn't even mean to find this. I mean, I was going to find it anyway. There's diamonds in my border? There's no way. Okay, but is there a cave spider spawner? I just have to know. That one small thing. Where does the border even end? Oh, uh, it's not looking like it. I, I don't think we do have one. Are you kidding me? It's directly on the other side. What? Oh, that is unfortunate. At its finest. Okay. Well, that's just sad. But there was another cave somewhere. Where was it? It was like to my right. Uh, okay, I think it was more along this way. I'm not going to lie. Uh, okay. Well, you know what? I'm going to go back up. And I'll come prepared with a lot more stuff. Because right now I don't have a lot. So I'll go back up and get some more stuff. Okay, we made it back up. And it seems to be night time. My food is ready. Nice. We'll use this charcoal to smelt that iron. We've got string, which is nice. I can... I can make a fishing rod! This is one of the best items in the game. Because I can get fish. I can now get fish. You know, this is a really interesting challenge. I quite like this. So, yeah, it's night time. So that means it's sleepy time. Yay, I've woken up again. All right, I need a bucket. That's why I need a bucket. Because then with this infinite water source from the crop, I now have access to infinite water. And I could also go fishing, but I'm not going to do that right now. I think it's best if I probably create some sort of like big underwater lake. That's actually a really good idea. I can make a huge underwater lake and go fishing in it. I don't actually know if that's going to like boost my odds or what, making the lake. But you know what? I'll make it anyway. I guess I'll just make it three by three for now. Wait, hold on a minute. They have fish have a higher chance of spawning from your fishing rod when it's raining, right? So I would just be better off fishing here, I guess. I mean, we'll just do one fish. Oh, the tree just grew. Are the villagers okay? Aww. I hope so. Also, you need to hurry up. I don't have all day. Maybe I'll just dig it behind the house, actually. Yeah. And I'm three by three behind the house. Then it will get the rain as well. Okay, I should be able to just... Oh, never mind. I can't do that. That's not allowed in here. Yeah, there we go. And then I can just go fishing. I don't know how long this is going to take. I'll just cut the video and see what I get. Oh! I- uh, Oh! I didn't get anything. Wow! This reminds me of how boring fishing really is. But do you know what's not boring? Exploring caves. That's always fun. So, I'm going to make a shield, I guess. Not- That's not really that useful. And, um... I'm going to use this iron for a lot more valuable stuff. Flint and steel. I'm going to make shears. And I will make... What the? Oh, the iron golem is having a battle outside. I need to see this. Wow, this isn't even a battle. This is violation. Straight to the golem. Oh. I'm not trying to expose so much of the world outside. I'll, I'll just wait for him to die, I guess. I'll save, I'll save the rest of my iron for now. 
I am going to go down and explore in the cave. We'll go down the ladder again. Okay, we're back down at the mine shafty bit. I'll also mine that and... You know what I should have made? I should have made a pickaxe. Why? Why did I only just think of that as soon as I got down? All right, just give me a minute. Okay, I got my pickaxe. Finally, I did something right. That means we can also mine up this gold. Oh, there was more than one. I don't even know if the gold is going to be useful, I'm going to be real. Um, also, I don't have that much wood. I mean, I guess I can mine these planks. And you know what the fence is would be pretty useful as well. Because then I can, like, trap animals in them. Oh, another cave spider. You guys can just sort of sneak through sometimes. Or just spawn in. Also, there's iron here. I was being blocked by the plank, which was quite nice. So I'll get these fences and I'll dig around this area because I want to try and find some stuff. So, first I want to see how many more ladders I can make. I'll make a second crafting table. I'm not going back up there again. <laughs> not again. Oh my goodness, imagine if I forgot something else. How many ladders can I make? Nine. Okay. Well, let's have us come down here and then we can build the extra ladders down here right in the middle. How many is that? That's... Oh, let's save as much as we can. Okay, have we got anything? That's the fourth block. Oh, we dug right onto lapis. Lapis? Is a lapis gonna be useful? I don't know, but I also can't place my torch down because I don't want to place it on lapis. Well, I guess we'll find out if lapis is useful. Blue dye, I guess. Blue dye, that's a win. I love blue dye. I like it when it's blue. Oh, I found redstone! Nice! We're finding all the good stuff. Oh, some of it might have been cut off by the border. That's okay. We're, we're heading a step in the right direction. Okay, what's over here? Oh, tripstone! There might be a dripstone cave here. There is a dripstone cave here! Look at this! I absolutely called it, but I mean, I kind of did expect this. Now... Now, MD George, you are in a very dangerous situation right now. You have no armour, barely any food. Are you seriously going to adventure in this cave? Yes, I am! This is the best opportunity I've been given this whole episode. And I'm not going to turn it down. Why can't I... Oh, you're annoying, thank you. Oh, not again. I hate dripstone sometimes. Oh, that drowned has got a fishing rod. Wow, imagine if I didn't craft it and I got it off of him. Also, I'd quite like that redstone. I'm going to try and block clutch. It's okay if I miss because there's water below me. Okay, I didn't miss. I mean, I did miss, but then I revived myself again. Nice, okay. Uh, let's go over here. Whoa, okay. See if I in this, like, little trench bit. Nope, absolutely zero things to find. Oh, we have lava! Lava, that's also a And a drown. You know what? I kind of want your loot. I want your rotten flesh. So, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to encase this lava in here. And make sure you don't burn. That means if we take it home, we have infinite cobblestone. Oh, we did get the fishing rod. It's extremely low durability. Probably worth just me doing that. Pretty much. Hey, you know what? I've got water at home. So if I do that, I can bring the lava up, make a cobblestone generator. Never have to worry about stone again. Okay, I just have to make this jump. Oh my goodness, right. This is really bugging me off right now. I'm just gonna do that. There we go. 
And then we can go over here and scoop this up. Nice, we have lava. Um, it's a shame that this cave was completely useless, though. I would have liked something down here. Oh, it's going to be really annoying making my way back up. But there's iron! We could mine the iron underwater. Why does it take so long? It's just iron. Iron is iron. Oh, I can swim like that. Okay, let's go back up. I also could not help but notice this gold over here. Um, yeah, you know what? On second thoughts, I'm not going to get that. That's stupid. Oh. Right. Let me build a connection. Uh, bridge. Make a bridge. There we go. Nice. We made a bridge. Bridge building successful. Right. Let me... I want to place it like, like that. You know, I can always hear stuff, but I never know where it is. That's so annoying. Wait a minute, where is this place? I didn't even mean to come up here. Oh, and this is the place with the diamonds! That I definitely didn't know about. Because I definitely didn't go into spectator mode. Drown! Rotten flesh, please. Oh, I can't do a critical thing. Yes, it dropped rotten flesh. This is the best day of my life. Skeleton! Shoot the down! Yeah! And it dropped the bone! Wow, exclusive items today. And we've got diamonds on the first day of... Well, on the third day, I'm pretty sure. Wow. This is going really well. You know what? I'm going to head up and think about how much of a good time I've had over here. So first I'm going to build a staircase. Also, I'm going to check what's up here. I'm very curious right now. Oh, nothing. Great. Great use of my time. Okay, I'll just go back down here. And Yes, to my to my mine, please. Oh, it's it's up there. Of course, it's up there. Yeah, I have to use a bridge. There we go. Nice. Let's go back to this. All right, here we are. Cows! Oh my goodness! We need the cows. All right, I need wheat. I need wheat right now. Do I have anything in this chest? Yes. Two wheat! Perfect! That means the cows won't despawn when I feed them. Aww. Right, come over here, cows! Today's your lucky day! You are never leaving! Again! Do you understand me? I, I hope you have said your last words right now. Honestly, I have no space. I don't know where to put you. Right, you know what? Plan B, put you in a hole. Okay, guys, I have a much better infinite source of food now. Yes! Yes! This is all going so well! And if I feed you guys, you won't despawn anymore. And we've got lava now, so we can make a cobblestone generator. I think I'll do it in here, in this nice little space. Um, let me just put that there for now. Quickly get the water from here. And we can make this cobblestone generator. Let's see if I can do this without messing up. It, it should should literally just do that. I'm pretty sure that's all it is. Yes! 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 We did it! We did it! Nice. We made a cobblestone generator. We're not stupid. We did it. Wow, we've done so much in this video. We explored caves, found diamonds, made a farm for crops, cows, trees, got infinite water, even found iron. Wow. You know, the more I think about it, the more I realize we did. So you know what? 
I'm gonna end today's video, but I am more than happy to do a part two. If this video gets 10 likes, I'll do a part two. I'm saying 10 because my long form videos have actually been doing quite well recently. Thank you guys for the support. I just want to take a moment to mention that. Don't forget to leave a like on this video as always if you enjoy and subscribe. I'll be trying to upload more long form videos throughout the weeks. And okay, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.